Sean Dothing here with our Skagit STEM Community Spotlight. With me here today is Leslie Smith from Edco Incorporated. Thanks for being here, Leslie. No, nah, you're welcome. Glad to be here. All right. So can you tell me just a little bit more about yourself and your company? Oh, Edco has been in business for about 45 years. We're a metal fabricator. And uh, we do a lot of work for local companies as well as nationwide. People will recognize uh, the work we do with uh, PACCAR or Lavalet or Hexel or Team Corporation or local general contractors like Skanska or Kiwit. Um, we serve a lot of different markets. We're quite diversified. So um, transportation infrastructure, aerospace, space and defense, uh, renewable energy, general construction. Uh, we serve a lot of really good folks here in their area. We're lucky to be here. Uh, 48 people on my team. Wow. Welders, machinists, uh, engineers, and support staff. Awesome. That's great. We're a good bunch. Yep. Cool. Yeah, I've been there. I've seen it. It is a good bunch. Yeah. Um, so why is STEM education so critical at EDCO? Well, um, one, because uh, I'm really committed to kids. Uh, it's a part of how I see us succeeding in the future, um, but it's really a, close to my heart in terms of uh, devotion to um, kids that think differently, uh, uh, people who like to build stuff, uh, that like to learn hands-on, that have a technical bent, that may not find a place for themselves in other spots. Uh, they could possibly find a place for themselves building things, either as a welder or a machinist, or as an engineer who likes work with a really multidisciplinary team. So uh, we really want to see that spark in kids. Uh, that's what gives us a lot of joy is to, you know, as, a, as a youth, um, being able to engage with them when they're young and, and maybe develop that spark at an early age. That's great. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. Um, so your company has been very involved with having an impact on the students in Skagit County. Um, why have you made such a strong commitment? Well, it, it, connects, um, it connects with that joy and that spark, um, that desire to really help people find a place for themselves um, and um, where they're accepted, where it's very inclusive, where it's a kind environment and where you can just build stuff. It's really fun. It's really rewarding. You can have a lot of pride in it. You know what you've done at the end of the day. It's very humbling too. You can make a mistake and it can uh, get you down, but you get back up when you're with a strong team that's really oriented toward problem solving. So, um, so it's a very, um, it's a very grounding profession, manufacturing, and you see the excitement in kids when they can when they can do something hands on. So the commitment's really easy uh, for me. Um, it's the, both the people and the hands on and the immediate success and the continued growth and constant growth and development um, uh, for people's careers and for their lives. It's for, it's, a, it's a very concrete way to make a difference. Oh, that's great, Leslie. Thank you so much. Um, and really, the Skagit STEM Network would like to thank you so much for all that EDCO has done and are doing for students in the community. Um, so you guys, you too. We're, oh, you're welcome. We are so excited and 100% in support of what you and your team are doing. Thank you. You're, you're, you are what it's all about. Thank you. Thanks. All right. Yep.